my question on that is whether those people have to work up to a certain point to be able to work with Republic or uh, before that, do you provide any support so that when they meet with you, they're already at a, at a good point? Um, and I think this goes to all the startups that are engaged with Viet Challenge as well, whether you provide any yeah. support for them to get to the point. Yeah, you know, those are, those are excellent questions um, because we're an investment platform uh, and not a philanthropic platform. We want to pick companies that are diverse, but also are strong, you know, so that our own investor have a chance of getting return on that investment. Mm -hmm. So the belief here is that there are very talented, promising startups that are overlooked gotcha. uh, and we want to attract them. The mission is not everyone. Okay, how about this? You know, the, the, the failure rate for a restaurant is like 95% or something like that in the US. Yeah. Not everyone should or can be uh, running a new startup because it's a very, very difficult journey. So uh, to answer your question, those who are so committed and, and well-intentioned and really believe in a solid business model, of course, the education and support come in a couple of waves uh, through community partners like Viet Challenge and Techstars and Y Combinator. We want to provide information, content, first and foremost. The next step up is that the companies that are really strong just know that you don't have to raise a hundred thousand US dollars to take the next step. Dell Computer, HP, uh, Apple, Whole Foods, they all started on less than 10,000 US dollars, which is already a lot of money in Vietnam, but know that you can start relatively small. So if you have, if you, let's say, I'm just gonna give you a very concrete example. Let's say if there are two founders from Haifang or Dalat, from modest background, but they, uh, they have this amazing idea and they, uh, we believe that they're going to build the next, you know, whatever you call it, Uber in Vietnam or Tesla in Vietnam or what have you. We hope that we can market and get the work out to the communities in the U.S. and beyond so that people like my older siblings or myself having that allegiance, that heritage, to Vietnam as an ecosystem will say that, you know what? I think this is awesome. I don't have $10,000, but I'm gonna put in $500. And if you have a thousand people do that, that's $500,000. If you have 10 people mm -hmm. doing, or a hundred people doing that, that's a $50,000. $50, so uh, the, the, the support that we do is both on content, on preparation, and then the, those that we believe can leverage the power of the crowd and have a solid business fundamental. We provide marketing support and the support of our partners, you know, like Viet Challenge, oftentimes the other way around, meaning Viet Challenge would already provide this amazing foundation for founders and then they bring it to Republic, uh, those who are already uh, able and suitable to be actual.